Welding in itself at Palm Beach State College is, in my opinion, probably one of the best trades. With the curriculum here at Palm Beach State College, it's very focused on safety. It's very focused on creating a very safe environment, a very productive environment. I like to use that term, the sky's the limit, for this program because once you're done, the sky is the limit. You can go anywhere, you can work anywhere, and the accreditations that you get, not only from the National Construction Center for Education Research, the NCCER, but also Palm Beach State College, um, they'll allow you to travel worldwide. I've noticed as somebody who's coming from the field into this, as an instructor, there's still a high demand for fabricators. There is. People have to have things fabricated, welded, things have to either be repaired or built. Where does that demand come in? Well, you can get the training here. And, and it's a very productive environment. It's not student on top of student in you know very small clusters. It's a very open environment. The booths that we have, there's a lot of um, very up-to-date, modern equipment that we have to where you're constantly learning the new processes and staying up-to-date. There is a lot of technical stuff that we teach. There's a lot of basic stuff that we teach. So if you're coming off the street and you have knowledge, we help you build on that knowledge and then polish you up a, a, a lot and then send you out there and that just means that you have more training. For somebody that knows nothing that wants to get into it, we pick you up from ground zero. Along the way, we're also accrediting you and then we send you out in the world. We also have uh, secondary programs that come back for MIG, TIG, and STIC. And those are different types of processes and welding that we also do additional training for, which is, which to me is exciting because being in the service industry in Florida, there is a lot of need for specialized fields, and we do a lot of that training here. The booths, the the equipment that we have, as far as the amount of training, that cost is is a fraction of what it would be to go to a private industry, and the reason being is because of the fact we have we have this this generated overall system here at the college, the PSAP, post-secondary adult vocational, where we do a lot of this up-to-date training and we make it very affordable to the people that are out in the community that want to come in. We give you top-notch training, but we also have people here that help you get a job. And I'm constant in touch with people out in the field, so there's job placements available. I mean, I get calls every day for welders, every day. And guys that haven't even graduated yet, you know, I, I don't know many trade schools that do a lot of job placements like Palm Beach State College does. We really are hands-on with our students to try and get them placed immediately as soon as they get out of here, immediately into the workforce so there's no lapse, there's no gap in time. I'd recommend anybody to do it. Anybody that's just out of high school, that's not sure where they want to go, and they're looking for a really great career, I can definitely tell you, and the funny thing is, is I'm a graduate of the same program that I'm now teaching. So as a really good career, as a stable career that's going to give you longevity in the future, there's always going to need, be a need for welders. And the qualifications that our instructors have, I believe, are top notch. And we pass that on to our students. It's not something that we just are regurgitating out of a book. We're also incorporating our life lessons and things that we've learned in hands-on and, and what I would call real-world experience. It's not just a male-driven industry. We want females. You know, we want the guy that doesn't think he can do it to come and try. Because a lot of stuff that we do pushes people and pushes their potential. We have a lot of what we call aha moments, where we have students that know nothing about what they're doing, and then one minute, aha, now I know what I'm doing. And it really, that you see that light bulb turn on over their head, and it's amazing to see that they actually are turning into it. And then next thing you know, it's just this ball of snow that's rolling down the hill, picking up so much momentum. It's like you just you just tap it off the side of the mountain and then watch it go. And that's very encouraging to me and that's how we have a lot of our students. We, we, we work on positive reinforcement and encouragement. So if you're out there, you're, you're not sure what you want in life, if you're not sure, if, you, if you're sick and tired of working in a fast food or a restaurant that's unappreciated, come see us.